I'm really fascinated by crude strength. When you have a dollar that's popping, uh, you have base metals getting hit really hard, but yet you take a look at the curve and you're still seeing very strong prices in the front month uh, versus a few months out. Is that what we're dealing with or is there something else going on? No, I think you're spot on because if you look at the macro picture, you would think after the after what the Fed said and at least the market's interpretation of uh, Fed's hawkish stance and the dollar rallying, you'd think that at least crude would pause. It did mm -hmm. pause for a day. That was yesterday. And it's back up rising. I think fundamentally the crude market hasn't been this tight for a very long time. Now, you'd probably ask me, well, OPEC has a lot of spare capacity and it does. Mm -hmm. uh, but if Iran isn't coming back, the, this squarely puts what happens to the oil market in Saudi Arabia's hands. Uh, Saudi Arabia maintains 40 percent of uh, global spare capacity. And should it choose not to bring it back, then we can have an incredibly tight summer because, yes, we have the spare capacity. But if they are on the side of caution thinking, look, Iran could come back any time. We're not out of the mm. woods yet, something Abdulaziz himself said, then, yeah, the, the game is on.